Hello, welcome to the show. Happy Friday. Senator Joe Manchin is finished, finished with the bill. He talked to Chuck Schumer today and he says, I am finished with the bill. I'm only for one thing. I'm finished with climate change. I'm only for helping the people. Doing another bill will just put gasoline into the fire. I might support something in the month of August. I'm waiting to see July inflation as the people are struggling. Hello everybody, I'm Sal Capano. This is like a, a circus. Every day, think some, some things change in mansions on board a little bit. He's off board. Um, and this is not the first time he's mouth off and he's saying, they asked him a question to reporters about President Biden. Is, is it all his fault in inflation? And you can't believe what he said. Also, stay tuned to the end of this video. A power solar flare. What is that, Sal? Maybe you've heard already. <laughs> is the world going to end? No, not quite yet. But some things, this also, this happened in the year 2000, and I'm going to go over that in this video. Hello. I'm just so happy to be on here reporting the news, and thank you. Thank you for all the likes and support of my Uncle Frank. Um, I will bring some good news. He's doing a little bit better, and he might go home. I'm not going to get into uh, all the details uh, on his situation but thank you, thank you so very, very much. All right, um, it's my pleasure to be here. And before we go any farther, uh, make sure if help out the YouTube algorithm here and just hit the like button, share this video if it's helpful for you or others as it helps our station out. All right, sit back. All right, so let's let's talk about this Mansion thing. So Senator Mansion says I'm finished with the bill. I'm rejecting the bill. I seen the 9.1 uh, inflation. It came out for June. Let's just take a chill pill. Oh, he didn't say chill pill. Let's relax and see what happens to July. But he is for one thing. Now, you stay with me for this whole uh, video here. This is going to get really interesting on this. Um, so, he says this. He says, I want better health care. Well, he's right. The health care right now for two. Obamacare is going to go be so high that an average family with inflation and, and everything else rent will be like an average of two, a couple could be up to 350 and it won't cover a lot of the hospital stuff, be high deductibles. So that he says he wants to better health care. Obamacare is not working. So he took a shot at uh, former President Barack Obama. Let me know in the comments below. And he's also, he says, I do support lowering prescription drugs. Now the Republicans are on board with all this with Manchin. So has Manchin become a Republican? But he did finalize and says, we need to help out the people. So help the people like what? Stimulus. So right now, Manchin is just rejected it right now. And here we go, wait another month on some kind of stimulus and gasoline. It really aggravates me. Uh, I'm not saying I'm for Manchin, against Manchin, both part. It's just a total mess because I know a lot of us are struggling. And again, continue to say a lot of people I know on here have lost their homes, apartments, et cetera, homeless. And it breaks my heart. Now remember to uh, leave a comment because I am going to give out another um, a congratulations to SNS and all the winners from the past. I think Toby is one and uh, Too Beautiful. And I go all the way back. Um, we had some big giveaways. I'm going to continue to do my help. So it uh, doesn't hurt. And on this channel, I'll give out a little bit. All right. So let me continue. So um, now, in other news, New Mexico has just announced another state. So you're going to stay tuned to future videos. A $500 tax rebate. Now it says to all residents. So some kind of a tax rebate. So more and more states are coming on board. So hopefully they start, hopefully your state that you're at will, you know, come on board with this. That's all we have right now until, you know, um, they decide what they're going to do. Now let's talk about this um, powerful solar flare. And there's the photo. Again, it's heading towards Earth at a radio blackouts are possible. Now this happened, okay, you might, a lot of you might remember in 2000, it was called, uh, hopefully I'm pronouncing this right, a Bashil Day event. Uh, and this is supposed to be worse, meaning your cell phones might not work. They're saying up to maybe even 14 days. Internet might be in and out. Air, air flights might be suspended for a day or two. Um, so this could be serious. It happened July 14th in 2000. 
Anybody remember that, let me know in the comments below. Again, it's not the end of the world. It's not an asteroid. It's a powerful solar flare. Now, it's a lot of reports that I'm reading saying it's it's something like this is going to happen. If I remember right, I thought it happened like five years ago where um, the service was in and out on cell phones. So if you are starting to experience some problems with your phone, your carrier now, it very well could be this is starting to happen. They didn't give exact date, but I'm assuming very in the days to come. So let me know. You think this is all, you know, blank? Um, uh, but uh, there, there's something to it. Again, it could be worse with cell phones not working, computers and internet, and it could knock out um, um, airfare, uh, airfare, um, airlines, stuff like that might not be able to fly. Um, power outage, it said, is possible as well. So. Oh, just something else that we have to uh, keep our eye on. But uh, again, um, I was watching some videos and they were saying it's going to be, this is going to be it. No, no, it's nothing like that. It's just going to be with the, uh, it's a solar. It's, it's, it's a solar with something to do, you know, with the sun and it's heading towards Earth. Hey, everybody, uh, if you're enjoying these videos, once again, hit the like button. Um, if you'd like me to go live uh, this evening, um, let me know get my mind off of things I just uh, anything you want to talk about um, see if I get a response if I get a, a response more than 10 I will go live um, it's getting dark maybe outside I might have a cocktail with me it's been one heck of a week uh, for me um, weird thing weird day yesterday a lot of weird things were happening but I'm fine just strange things I'm not gonna get into it. let me know how your day is how your week was and uh, well, we'll see. Again, this is the news. I wish it was better news, but a lot of you uh, support my channel and come on and see me every day when I'm on to report the facts. And this is the facts. Um, you know, could things change when the report comes out in July? And Manchin could be, hey, right back on board, but we'll have to wait and see. He is right about health care. This is uh, something they need to worry about. But in my opinion, just my opinion, there's money there, a lot of money sitting there, and there's no reason why they, they, they're playing games with us and sent out something. Uh, and don't give it to the states. Don't let the states control it, like PUA and unemployment and, and, and other things, because some states are and some aren't. I don't think it's fair. I think this is, um, we didn't ask for none of this, and I think at least one more stimulus. If you know, considering the gasoline, and it's coming down a little bit, and food and everything. I'd like to hear from each and every one on you. All right, uh, hey, it's my pleasure. And once again, say hello to somebody. Uh, tomorrow's another day. There's always a solution on this channel. God bless everybody. Let me know about the live. Uh, come on, and we'll go live for an hour. Thank you.